Hello guys, welcome to another time out with me on the channel. My name is Alec Godwin if you meet me for the first time and today we are going to Mars. Ladies and gentlemen, Siri has just taken us to Mars. Alright, if you're here for the first time, I'd like for you to um, subscribe to the channel. Um, here we do music movies, tech reviews, short films, the whole nine entertainment gear and all that. Um, so basically if you love to watch movies or learn how to make movies then this is the channel for you. Now quickly, I am coming up, um, it's a coded uh, project for now, more will be coming later, it's a very long project. I'm not going to be talking about it that much like it's coming out next week. No, it's a very time consuming project. It's going to take a long time. But however, I'm going to be shooting that project in anamorphic and I've been trying to sort out the right peak. And um, I finally concluded that I was going to go with Siri. And just when I was trying to make my purchase, I saw that uh, an anamorphic cine set was coming soon. Actually, I wanted the 35 first and I couldn't even get the 35, so it wasn't available right now. And so I'm thinking like, should I wait for those? However, I'm not ready to dish out 4,000. Ah, yeah, that's what it, it costs for all four sets. Don't get me wrong, it's cheap. It's not bad for anamorphic lenses, but I wouldn't be needing all set for this project, and I'm trying to keep the budget low. So I want just the 35, and maybe, maybe after some test runs, I'll get the 50. But um, I'm like, this is tempting now what i really want is not available i don't know for now and i'm going to show you some clips um which are available on the amazon page i don't know if if, if what's going to come out it will be the you know i don't know if they're going to be selling single sets of of those if i if i can get the cine 35 for example standalone or the cine 50 standalone i don't know i think they're gonna do it eventually but i'm not sure they want to start with that yet uh so four grand for the set of four anamorphic lenses that's not a bad deal really i can't complain for that if i was going all out for it but um so i'm taking a minute i'm just holding on a minute i'm trying to see if that's what i'll do yeah. actually actually i'm going to reach out to them today after this video and ask if i'm if i'm going to be um uh, able to get the cine 35 instead of uh, the um previous one now i know it's a little bit heavier i think i think uh, i don't know how much heavier so uh, those will be the factors though, but uh, um, it will be lovely to have the Cine with one with the gears and probably they even have some improvement on it. That's what I expect, you know. I mean, every flaw, any flaws that was um, reported on the previous one will probably be fixed. Uh, so that's my, that's my thought, you know. Plus Cine lenses are always a better experience. So they might tweak it a little bit you know kill down some of those too busy anamorphic flares uh especially on the 24 and um yeah they might fix something so it might be a better buy at the end of the day but will they be selling one um so things to consider if you're thinking about that is the weight the size is a little bit bigger but from what i see it is nowhere near the vason cine set <laughs> nowhere near it so i think you should be good for that and the good thing is that it came it has this um uh, base mounting base if you need to mount to the lens instead of the camera which you'll see in the in the in the video it's good news 
for people who are just trying to get it set right now if you're trying to get it set for the um i mean three thousand was the price for the previous one or three and some change i would advise just go for the cine set wait for the cine set and um, go for it um but if i can get the cine set if they don't sell one of each right now i might just sell it for the previous 35 which is still good i have no problem with that and then um later on down the road if we decide we could go for the set in another video i'll explain how and why i decided to settle for for this for the serial yeah and um i think uh, i think they're doing a good job and i'm surprised that it's an american company i never really heard anybody talk about that i know uh Vazin is from china or so but Siri is an american based company so that's something that we should support i mean we support the chinese companies and the japanese and all true you know with all our girls and everything um why not why not do this for for an american base so uh but that's not the reason i chose it i chose it because it fits my project okay so i just wanted to throw that out there um let me know what you think what you think about this new set is this something that uh, strikes your attention? I don't know, but I really would love to have uh, the Cine 35. And um, however the case may be, I'll get, keep you posted. And by the way, I'll be shooting with the Panasonic BGH-1. That's the anamorphic camera I'm going to be used shooting with, the Panasonic BGH-1. And uh, we're gonna watch out for some actually the real reviews coming up so um, i've got some little videos coming out gear and rig setting up and yeah just watch out on the channel don't forget to like subscribe and so you can see all the new goodies that's coming on the channel soon i got some good news coming and some giveaways coming so you want to stay locked thank you guys for watching i guess i'll see you in the next one peace